Uh, hey, uh, hey, Wyatt? Mm. Uh, why are you sleeping? Is it time for 1000 Pine Tree Church Camp for the kids? Already? Um, we, we already went to that, Wyatt. Oh, what are we here for? Uh, it's an all-nighter, so I don't know, I don't know why you're sleeping, because there's no sleeping at all-nighters. Oh, yeah. Huh. Well, let's get started. Hey, kids, welcome. It's time for the all-nighter. We're going to do a relay game for some relay fame. So let's step out here and see what games we're cooking up with today. <laughs> Our first game is going to require two people from your team. It's called Plunge and Roll. You're going to be sitting on both of these carts, like so. Take your plunger and begin to row. Row around to the cone. Make it around the cone and make it all the way back. Then your next teammate will do the same thing. Once you're done, you can head to the next game. Let's check it out. Come on. This game is called... <laughs> it's a frog game. Now there's going to be pieces of Velcro inside this two tub. <laughs> Not a two. You two. You're going to be given a frog. This game requires three people from your team. You're going to run with your frog in hand, and you're gonna find a piece of the Velcro and stick it on, and then run back, tag your next partner until three of you have done. Done and gone. And then once you're done with that, you can come to the next game. Come on, let's check this game. It's called horse play, because it's all about horses. You're gonna need a table, a cup, and a ball, just like a horse. You're gonna start with the ball over here, and you're going to blow it. Don't use your hands, kids. We won't like it if you blow the ping pong ball into this cup that's at the end. This game requires three people. So after the first person goes and makes it, a second will do the same, and a third will do the same. Does that make sense? Are you understanding what's going on right now? I give up, this game's too hard. Face the cookie. This will require two of your players from your team. Each one of you will sit in a different seat, and you're gonna put one of these, <clears throat> one of these twist and show, Great value brand cookies on your forehead. And you can't use your hands. Get the cookie from your forehead into your mouth and eat it. Once you're done with that, and your partner is done with that, you can go to the next game. Let's check it out. Our next game is called Cornhole. You might remember it from the 1000 Pine Tree Camp Place. This requires three people from your team. You're gonna have to stand a certain distance, which we'll tell you later, and you gotta make it in. All three of you have made it in. We went to the next game. Let's check out the next game. Wow, it's right here. For this game, you're gonna need your entire team, but you're gonna be split into two groups. One half of your team will have a puzzle that they have to solve. As soon as that first half is done with the puzzle, the second group can start their own puzzle. Once you guys are entirely done, you can move to the inside. Let's go inside. Don't kiss anyone. We wouldn't be too happy. Uh, if you... Wait, what? What? Yeah. That's the wrong video. Oh, you're right. Sorry. Let's pretend we're in the fellowship hall because we're not there right now. Our first game is going to be Magic Carpet Ride. You're going to need two players from each team. The first player is going to get on a carpet similar to this. You're going to have your feet here and your hands here. You can't touch anywhere else. And you're going to scoot. Pretend I'm moving. You're going to scoot from one end of the fellowship hall to the other, and then your partner will do the same. As soon as you guys are done, we'll roll over to the next game. Come on! Now this game requires everyone from your team. You're gonna pick one guilty victim from your team, preferably someone small, if you're smart, and you're gonna wrap them up in toilet paper from head to toe. So once they're entirely wrapped, you can move on to the next game. So the next game is gonna involve two players from your team. You're gonna have two bags of Skittles poured out into a giant bowl. You're gonna to have to organize all of them by color into the individual cups we provide. Once you're done with that, the next game. That's not funny. All right, kids, here's the next game. The game is called Hanky Panky. It's gonna require three of you from each team, and you're all going to go at the exact same time. So for each player, you're gonna have a tissue box, and you're gonna pull out every individual tissue as fast as possible. Once all three of you have emptied your tissue boxes, you can move to the final portion of the game. Now this part is really important. This is what the 80s and the 90s were all about. And you're gonna make your parents proud. 
Maybe. You're gonna go to the backyard and you're gonna make a human pyramid with your entire team. Once you're done, you're gonna win the entire game. Thanks for watching. Be sure to tap that bell for notifications. Um, become a patron. Um, thousand points. That, I'm going back to bed.